Hello guys, Nelson Virtual with ExcelMail.com. I'm here to talk about a concern I have. I have seen more and more younger men posting on ExcelMail.com with symptoms of low testosterone. They post their blood work sometimes, their blood tests, showing low testosterone, and they're really basically in their late 20s. My first question to them is, have you used anabolic steroids in the past? Most of them have said yes. Some of them have cycled on and off a few times. Some of them just cycle once for a few weeks, you know, over 12 weeks or so. Most of them have been off anabolic steroids for over six months, and they're still having had their testosterone production go up. See, anabolic steroids decrease your testosterone production. You're basically, your testicles shut down. They make you gain muscle, obviously, strength, and most people like to feel good and look good. However, anabolic steroids use on their own without testosterone replacement can decrease sex drive and eventually they will shut down your hormonal axis. That hormonal axis or a cascade is not renewed or reset even after a few weeks off, this, off anabolics and testosterone. So a lot of men stay in a level of low testosterone for a long time. Their quality of life decreases, sex drive decreases, erectile dysfunction increases, their strength, mood, everything else gets worse. So I'm very concerned. Men in their late 20s should not have low testosterone unless you have genetic issues or maybe a traumatic head injury. When you are doing or you're thinking about doing anabolic steroids, and I'm not against anabolic steroids, my first book called Built to Survive was written about anabolic steroids and their use in treating people with HIV wasting. So I know they can be life-saving drugs. However, be aware that your hormonal cascade may be shut down for a long time, and in some cases we've seen permanently after you stop anabolic steroids. And you may need testosterone replacement therapy for life. It is a concern I have. I think it's not spoken or discussed enough. And it also exposes young people that want to have a better body, that want to feel good, to the potential risks that they may actually take by doing so. When you get off anabolic steroids, your testosterone will be shut down and repressed for a long time. You're going to lose the muscle mass you gained, the strength you gained, and the quality of life you gained. Unless you're doing it with proper monitoring, it is not a good idea to do. Don't abuse anabolic steroids, and if you're going to do so, at least read my harm reduction guide that is available in the description of this video. Be well and be healthy and thank you for listening.